Hey guys, uh, Jason from Friends of Comic Con is here. Um, you guys are both so good at blending uh, comedy with, with different genres. How, how how do you do that? Because <laughs> um, so yeah, comedy is hard, right? I mean, you either get a laugh or you do not get a you laugh. Fail, yeah. Yeah, and then you fail miserably. And if you have a bad joke, then. It's well, what really are they true. Use? It's so true. It's um, it's so hard because of what you said. There is success. They laugh, or, or it's misery. There's not like a middle ground. They kind of thought it was funny. That's that's a fail. Yeah. But, but how do you do it? Is what I was asking. I don't know. I can't tell you. I'm. Uh, you try. You do. And then uh, if you realize it doesn't work, you you cut it out and uh, hope that the next one works. Um, I think what I've seen him do is find things that are funny in real life and put them in his script or exaggerate them, but they're based on real people and real faults that people have. And, um, I, I would, as an outside observer of how he works, I, that's what I recognize in the scripts. That's why I, I like the comedic characters, because you see a little bit of yourselves in them, it's embarrassing and you laugh, or um, maybe he's exaggerated a trait, but you see the truth in, in it. and. Um, I think it start, probably starts there with his work. I mean, it, what also helps is hire funny people, like uh, funny actors. That's, yeah. that's, uh, that makes your life easier. Um, <laughs> yeah. These guys. Um, yeah. And then also, like, stick to the classics. Like uh, people tripping down, down some stairs and uh, yeah. getting your head smashed in by a... Uh, <laughs> yeah. Slapstick. Slapstick, yeah. Yeah, there, there's some great uh, martial arts action in, in this film. Uh, what, yeah, what, what are some of your uh, favorite uh, martial arts films? Um, trying to figure out what, what my favorite uh, Jackie Chan movie is, which is kind of hard, but I think it might be uh, Police Story 3. Um, really, really like. And... Um, the, the raid is amazing. That's obviously it's really an amazing action movie. Um, and martial arts movie, Ong Bak is an amazing martial arts movie. Um, End of the Dragon is an amazing martial arts movie. Like, there's so, so many. It's really hard to tell. What, what is your favorite one? I'm not, I'm not really a student of martial arts films. I know very little about them, in fact. And um, I was more a fan of your style. And what you did with your trailer, that's why I became interested in this film and backing more. It's, um, but I don't know that much about the first parts of this. Sam, are there any recent films that, that you've really, uh, really enjoyed? I thought Barbarian was great. Our producers, Alex Levicki, was one of the producers. Roy Lee was one of the producers. And uh, I, we worked uh, great together in, on other films as well. But. Um, that one was fantastic. Yeah. And uh, Sam, obviously, you have, you have a lot of fans from your films. Uh, Ritz, uh, this is new to you. How, how do you guys feel about uh, Comic Cons and, and, the, and the fans? What, what are some of the things that stand out? I'm, uh, I was so, like, this coming here was a literally a dream of mine. Like, uh, I, I would want to do that. Um, and I've had anxiety, excitement, plan, just plain fear for the last 48 hours. But now that sort of the toughest part is over, I'm so happy and I love it here. Yeah, this is the place where um, the movie lovers come. The real movie lovers come to get as close as they can to the movie. So for film director and producer, um, it's the place to be. Yeah, and lastly, is, is there a possibility of a Boy Kills World sequel? We, uh, we hope so. It all depends on how it pans out, right? Uh, go, go see the movie, the more tickets we sell. Yeah, if the audience wants to see another chapter in this story, then we'd love to work on it. Thank you, guys.